good afternoon, you guys. <clears throat> well, if it's not one thing, it's another. I am <clears throat> not working today. Here's remote control. Let me mute this. I have my husband and I, we've been up all night because of me. My throat feels a lot better. Um, but at around 1.45, I couldn't take the pain in my body any longer. He had to take me to the emergency room. And my insurance company has an emergency room. I have Kaiser. And we went. And they drew a lot of blood. And did the COVID swab. They did everything that the urgent care did. And, um. Everything came back negative. My thyroid will come back tomorrow or today. But they just seem to believe that I have oh, this some kind of virus that's going around that doesn't have a name. Um, but when I tell you the pain in my body, it feels so much better now. Um, but my head still hurts, so I did take my ibuprofen. They said continue taking the antibiotic, and I did that. Um, I had a lot of energy this morning because I did record a the Valentine salad that's going viral on TikTok. I recorded that. I need to do a voiceover on that because I look horrendous. And I sound horrendous, so I need to do a voiceover. Um, this is worse than COVID. My pressure was extremely high. I'm talking about 175 over 116. But they told me that I could go home as long as I come back on Friday doctor's appointment on Friday so they can kind of see what the heck is going on. Um, right now I'm in, I'm, I'm a little achy, not a lot, but just a little in my body, but my head is about a, on a scale of one to 10, I'd say a six. So it's tolerable. I have a lot of medication that I have to take. <clears throat> so, um, my husband just got home. And he's going to pick up my medicine. I'm, I'm, uh, he's going to pick up everything except for the nausea. Last night, I was nauseous. The doctor came in and he was like, listen, you have a virus. You're going to be okay. Because I was convinced I was dying. I was convinced I was dying. He said that little dangly dang in the back of my throat. Uvula, 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 I think that's how you pronounce it, was extremely inflamed. Um, and I had no temperature though, which is weird because normally with viruses you do get, or any kind of infection you normally get in you know, your temperature goes up. Not me. My pressure went up. And he was saying, it's probably because you're in so much pain. So he said, listen, I'm going to give you something for the pain, but it's a shot. And I said, okay. And he was like, I can tell you're in pain. Because normally people would say, I don't want the shot. I'm not going to lie, I was scared about that shot, but I was, I had to do something. One was a steroid and one was the pain reliever. So I got those two shots in the butt, thank God. 
because as a lot of you have noticed, I have a, I'm thick in that area. <laughs> so it's probably the best place to get a shot. Um, what else? So he gave me the, I got the two shots. I was given something for the nausea. I just had a little bit of nausea. They gave me the dissolvable pill that you put on your tongue and it dissolves. I don't even remember that dissolving. It just... And then he also gave me a muscle relaxer. And that was at about maybe three this morning. And I still feel it's, it's strong. And then he also gave me something, some thick, a thick liquid. It was really thick. It was clear. And it makes your throat numb. And not only does it have a numbing effect to the throat, it numbs your entire mouth. And it tastes like butt. And I, I made sure to let them know it tastes like, I'm just saying. But it numbed my throat. And see now I can swallow and it doesn't hurt. It's just good. So he gave me a lot of relief. We got there around 1.45 in the morning. And we got home around 5. So that's not bad. I'm thankful that Kaiser has their own um, emergency room. Because had I gone, gone like to the regular like... Piedmont Henry or Grady I'd have still been there and I know for a fact they would not have allowed me to go home because of my pressure and remember I was telling you guys that I couldn't get an appointment until March they made it where I can see my doctor tomorrow I'm still congested I can still take the ibuprofen which I did Come here, love. Want we'll come up here? So, yeah. Won't be alone much longer. He's coming back with my medicine. <coughs> and I'm, oh, I'm grateful for that. I think you turned the TV off. Yeah, you do. No, you can't. In a minute, I'm gonna feed. You wanna get down? What you want to do? Go over there. In a minute, I'm going to feed this puppy. He can, I found out that he can eat um, tofu. I've been giving him just a little bit of tofu. <coughs> yeah, no, absolutely not. But yeah, so I've just been laying down. And when I tell you, I have a zero energy. So I'm saying all of this to say, hmm, I may not do the workout today. Um, if I can get my medicine in me and get a little bit of energy, I will. I need to do that voiceover for the candy, um, the Valentine gummy salad. Anyway, I'm going to go. I just wanted to update you guys. <laughs>